everyone! Today I would love to share with you the pattern of crochet Christmas ornament. I decided to decorate my home already. I see Christmas things everywhere around the city, so I decided to bring more Christmas spirit to my channel as well. And I share this easy crochet hard pattern that I already got on my channel, but somehow the video didn't get popular so I decided to repeat and show that this pattern is awesome for Christmas ornaments. You can use these stickers that I bought in Aldi but you can use similar ones, you can find them everywhere in one dollar stores or other craft stores and they really make these awesome look ornaments. You can even keep the heart by itself, it looks awesome on the tree as well and you can use different yarn combinations in case you don't have the sticker or you don't want them the heart with the yarn itself looks awesome so just like this the Christmas tree full of these hearts it's really beautiful you can use also these uh, festive threads that they sell now everywhere to make it more beautiful or use the yarn to make these loops so basically for this pattern the only thing you really need is some uh, Christmas color yarn and the hook so, and the scissors to cut the yarn. And of course you can make this heart just like this without the second half and to put it as an ornament. I prefer to put some fiber inside to make them look a bit fatter and to give this awesome shape. You can use your fantasy as you want and now I'm going to show you the pattern. So you can use any color, any yarn, acrylic. This one is wool, so it looks awesome with cotton, acrylic. I'm using a 2.5 millimeter crochet hook. Of course, if you make with a chunky yarn you get bigger heart with bigger hook. This one is just seven centimeters. It's perfect for any size Christmas tree. And of course you can make smaller, bigger, everything depends on you. So as usual, we're gonna start with the slip knot. I think those who watch my videos every time already learn how to make a slip knot very easy and then we're gonna chain eight so just grab your working yarn and chain eight one two three four and I forgot to mention that it's better to use smaller size hook than recommended so you have small holes so Two, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now I'm inserting my hook into the second stitch after the hook. So one and two into this one. Grab the yarn, two loops, and make one single crochet. Insert. And you have two. In total, we will have seven. Three. Four. Five. Six. And seven. Right now, chain one, turn your work, and insert your hook not into the first, but into the second stitch, and make one, two, three, 
in each row you will actually have uh, seven single crochet because this chain one it counts as a stitch so you have two four five and six and seven so we are going to crochet the square and like that chain one turn your work Keep the first stitch and insert into the second one. So with the chain one you already have two stitches. Now three, four, five, six and seven. And like that you must have seven rows. So row one, two, three. And like that you continue until you make seven rows. So now I have a square that has seven rows. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now we are going to turn our work, here our chain, yarn over, and we count the four stitch, one, two, three, and four, insert, let me see again, into the fourth stitch, and make one double crochet. One and like that insert into the same four stitch and make two and in total we are going to make seven three four In the same stitch six and seven so you create something that looks like that and now you're going to slip stitch into the corner that's one half of the heart so you can see here that's one half, we are crocheting now the second half. So to make a second half, yarn over and we find the middle. You can always fold and see that the middle is around here. So insert the hook into the center, it's not a stitch, it's just somewhere in the center and make seven double crochet. Three, four, five, six, and seven. So now we are going to slip stitch into the corner and you're gonna see the magic happen it's already looks like a heart right super beautiful and now you have a choice to change the yarn and you get this effect of two color yarn you can use or uh, to keep crocheting with the same color and you have this red color. I will not change to white so you can see better the stitches, but you can choose different color combination. Depends how you want your ornament to be. So I'm going to continue with the same red color 
and here I'm going to slip stitch and chain three. One, two, and three. So, uh, and now we are going to put here six double crochet. So together with chain three, you will have seven. Insert one. And then into the next one, you cannot see the stitches, but uh, approximately you can put close by another three, four, five. So here. I put six here. So now I put the seventh and recount one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And here is our last where we have the knot. We are going to put here one double crochet. And into the same stitch, we are going to put one treble. Two times yarn over and put, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. So, and then one double crochet into the same. So from the same stitch, we have one double crochet, one treble and one double crochet. Now yarn over and here, we put the same uh, seven double crochet. So put one. You cannot see the stitches here as well. Just put approximately. Sorry. Two. Just insert my hook where I have small spaces. Five. Here I see that I will have already this seven double crochet. So approximately six and seven. And now our heart looks like that. So here we have our uh, seven double crochet in each of them we are going to make an increase so in the first six we put two double crochet so an increase of two double crochet and in total we will gonna have 12 double crochet so one increase the second one third one an increase means two stitches together so the fourth the fifth and the sixth increase And now, uh, the last seventh stitch, we're gonna have um, one half double crochet and one single crochet. And now on this half, the same. We're gonna start with one single, one half double, and into the rest you put six increase of uh, double crochet, so 12 double crochet. So just insert 
and one of the half of our ha heart, we, it will be ready. So, when you will learn this pattern after making one heart, I'm sure you can remember it. It will be so easy and fast that in one hour, I promise you're gonna have many hearts and your Christmas tree can be decorated just with hearts and believe me it will be very beautiful and it's suitable especially for the bedroom decor because the hearts give this romantic feeling but you can decorate whatever even take some branches and put some hearts it will be also awesome so now we have our last increase I'm a bit fast because you already know how to make double crochet and increase and here we just finish with the slip stitch into our third chain so just insert insert here and our heart is done look how it's beautiful and you can already use it by itself but if you're going to crochet the heart with the two sides that looks awesome really I love it uh, you can crochet the second half like we did also you can have different color combination and theoretically it's better if you cut this yarn and just insert and make the other uh, like the other stitch to connect it but I don't like to weave a lot of ends so I normally just finish here and and now you insert the hook as if you want to slip stitch but instead of just make a slip stitch you also take the other yarn and see here you had an increase then after increase immediately insert into the next double crochet and you can slip stitch the two parts together like that and continue with the uh, two stitches on this side, two stitches on this just insert under both loops under both loops now you have the two stitches and make slip stitch then insert under both loops and make a slip stitch under both and you continue all around and don't forget to put some filling it could be anything actually you can even put some rice or some pasta to give some texture like you know whatever you prefer A scrap yarn some fabric it really doesn't matter what you put inside this heart so, slip stitch be careful to pick up all the stitches so I just continue like that and now I'm going to insert some fiber and finish the heart don't put too much if you put too much maybe the fiber can be seen but just make it a little bit better 
then just continue with your slip stitches all around Actually, you can make this heart very fast because the pattern is so easy, you will remember the favorite number of this pattern is number 7, 7 single crochet and then 7 double crochet and every time you will have 7 so it's super easy to remember. Now I have finished, to secure I will make another here and just cut the yarn already just with red color without any decor it looks awesome but of course if you have some stickers if you can make embroidery snowflake or reindeer or whatever it will be even more beautiful so, for example, you can see now if I can put this. I love snowflakes actually. <laughs> but even like this heart, you see, even heart on the heart, it looks so beautiful. Or this snowflake, I don't know, you can write in the comments below what you would like to decorate this heart with. What's your favorite? Christmas decor and tell me if you like this pattern I think it's too much here just maybe the two snowflakes mm, what do you think or even the star like let me find some stars something like that. I have also other stickers with green Christmas tree. So, um, well, I think for this one I even like how the heart was. So it looks different and it even gives more accent to the heart shape. What do you think? And you can use the You can use also the yarn actually to make the loop or you can make it more beautiful with this special thread just put inside. Actually I'm sure you already know how to just make this hanger but in case you are not good at this I just show you you can make it you can just actually tie it beautifully and very easily and it's already ready to be hand on the tree it's very beautiful you can hide this by putting here and then hiding the end inside the heart so whatever you prefer you can make with this heart that's it for today i'm really happy to share this pattern i hope you like this video tutorial and see you again next time thanks for watching happy crochet to everyone mm -hmm.